Do you want to do Grey Cowl of Nocturnal Quest? Then first you have to find the thief's corpse in the graveyard of Riften. The thief's body <laughs> will have a note that you have to read. Reading the thief's note will give you the next step of the quest. I wasn't sure what I was doing, so I had to read the quest description. Read the thief's note. After you read the thief's note, you have to find a beggar in the Riften city. Talking to the Riften beggar will allow you to get another note, but you have to tell him the special message. Shadow, hire you. And he will give you another note to read. The stranger's note. Next up, you have to go to Penn Island. Just kidding. You can go to Nivenor. Nivenor is a lady on the Riften docks, and you can uh, tell her that you have to go in, and go inside the Botley's house. And it's, uh, you tell her it's about to explode, and she will give you the key to the house and the strong box and give you money for whatever reason. And then you go to Botley's house and go on the top floor and open the strong box. In inside the strong box, you have to take the stranger's instructions and read the stranger's instructions. The stranger's instructions will tell you to loot the forged deed from the strong box. So you make sure you loot the strong forged deed in the strong box. Then you have to make your way all the way to solitude and visit a person named Gisli. And you pickpocket Gisli to take land, title, and deed. But be careful. If you fail, you will make people angry. So I recommend saving the game, also known as save scumming. Save, and if you fail, you load the game. Then you have to go to Erikur's house in solitude and go to the top floor. On the top floor of Erikur's house, you have to plant the deed in the dresser in his room that has the bed. Then you will get another step that tells you to check the barrel for further instructions. The barrel is located behind the inn in an alleyway or whatever. It's hidden quite well. It's not in the inn. It's outside the inn in a path behind the inn. And there you, you will get the next instruction telling you to go to yet another place in the middle of nowhere. You have to enter a place called Silver Drift Lair. I recommend taking the carriage to Dawnstar and walking from Dawnstar to this lair. Then you have to go inside this lair and look for a big chest that is locked. If you unlock this chest using your lockpicking skill, you will find the quest item and con can continue the next step of the quest which is going back to the rift and graveyard. You got the ancestral sword, now you go back to rift and graveyard with the sword and meet the stranger of the, of the grey fox, tomb of the grey fox. So I went to rift and, and to the graveyard and I had to pick up a journal from the floor. The journal of the floor gave me some nice story, bro. And when I took the journal I put in the inventory, I was visited by a masked person. And it was the grey fox, I guess. It just says stranger. And he will give you his helmet or the mask. Grey, grey something. Cowl, 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 cowl. Grey cowl of nocturne. And that is the end of the quest. And I was very excited to finish it.